Okay, folks, I was strolling along with this big fish on my shoulder looking for some place to cook it. <laughs> and I ran across these guys who build these things. What's your name, young man? Scott Wheeler with Custom Summer Kitchens. Scott Wheeler, Custom Summer Kitchens. If you want a grill like this, just give them a call. They build them all kind of ways. Scott, uh, anywhere? Anytime? Anywhere. We're, we do, uh, we're actually custom. We can build it any way you want it. Mm -hmm. There's all different types of appliances that you can put in them. Okay. We just built this sample here. You have your, your, your sink, your grill, access panels, um, refrigerators. There's double burners that you can put in them. Mm -hmm. um, you can put uh, power burners for doing your turkey fries. Okay. Uh, you usually recess those. Okay. Um, but any, your imagination, kegulators, your imagination just, we can build it. You and, think of it, we can build it. And this can be done, it's a stationary grill, so right. you want to build it in your right. house's backyard. Or right, or you can you can put it anywhere you want. you want. You can put it anywhere, lanai's, uh, we vent those mm -hmm. to allow the smoke to get out. Okay. Um, uh, there's nothing in these, it's all concrete, metal studs, tile, there's nothing, stainless steel, nothing's gonna rust or rot. All right. It'll be with you forever. Grand Turbo. Uh, folks, we, we're heating this up right now. I want to get up to about 400. And once we put, put our fish in, that should bring it down to about three fish when it's settling in. And uh, we're going to cook it for about, we're going to check it at about 45 minutes because salmon really doesn't have to cook through and through. Um, it's almost like steak. But you, you can get a really good flavor the way I prepared this salmon. So once we get it in the grill, we'll let it go, come back, kind of enjoy the, the, the surroundings, the concert, the uh, blast, and let this grill do its job. Thank you. <laughs> Now, is there, is there anything else that we have to know in reference to uh, you guys do some kind of uh, instructional thing with the, with the, the No, bias? they're pretty much, I mean, you can get them LP gas uh, or uh, propane uh, or natural gas, mm -hmm. um, or you can even get these grills, uh, the stainless grills in a um, um, you know, charcoal. Oh, really? Yeah, there's, there, you can get them in any different way. They're built-in models, they slide in, you know, they're, they're, they're to be stationary, and it's pretty, once you, once you cook once on it, it you cool. you tell you, you're, you're ready to go. <laughs> well, as you can see, this is heating up pretty fast. We have it on high so we could uh, get the temperature up right quick and then um, basically kind of regulate it back down. So it's new to me and it's new to the park, but it's not new to that fish in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, on the fish, you see some little brown uh, streaks. That's uh, molasses. We use the molasses and in the slits, we put some, some uh, sliced lemon. So once that kind of seeps into the skin of the fish, it's gonna flavor this thing. And we had a crowd here a minute ago. Unfortunately, in about 45 minutes, the crowd is coming back. <laughs> so, uh, you wanna give me a hand putting this on I me? sure will. All right, because the temperature is up to 400. That's a fast grill, buddy. All righty. Now, we'll just take the fish right here. Yeah. And this will keep your fish, I mean, your, your grill nice and clean. Okay. All righty. Mr. Natural, we're going to allow you to do whatever you need to do, okay? Well, thank you, sir. We're just going to kind of open it a little bit and let it go. Very good. <laughs>